The following recording is from Frozen Apples, metaphorically titled to reflect poetic excerpts from conversations, text messages, and emails over the past 11 years that are hereby frozen in time. Should fluttering flickers catch your glance, know it is me in dance. Should the flame ignite your temperature, know it is me in passion. Should sweet smoke from the extinguished wick swirl anticipation, know it is me wafting memory. Oh, moody November, grumbling prelude to coma tempest, winter's antechamber, frost-bitten earth, a random snowflake kiss, lips tasting like apple clove, sigh, sigh, and sweater secrets. Poets lament lions and lambs is March. Oh, bipolar mother nature, you are tantrum and squall. Laughing gusts, winking sunbeams, ice crystals and blended heat. A month's worth of constant, uneasy conundrum. Have you not noticed, earth dweller, my arcing limbs and swollen sod belly heaves in tempest and gasps in wind languishing sighs until is birthed Equinox's first tiny bud Tis my nature's right that calendar's laboring month is troublesome delivery unto springtime sublime. My infant blossoms cherubic face. So play on, violin, string lines of lions and lambs, sweetest of all earth nursery march rhymes. I've been in that jazz bar, lights on the down low, Eyes turn sugar, lips twitch, no words. Eyebrows weave volumes, a sigh, wink, alas, no evidence. The bookshelf tells of the inner man, a harbinger of words, paper trails, adventure, lust, college exams, national armament, cocktail recipes, fashion au courant, Plato, Aristotle, and Socrates, essential thinkers, history, art, and Spanish verbs, journals, headlines, a photo shoot, deep sea fishing, atlas, all hushed. Yet you shout, bookshelf. Feet on sand, toes foam tickled. I fell into a child mind, wondering if the sleeping stones were hollow. Would they float? August, welcome weekend, for a single enchanting heartbeat, an hour, or one midsummer night, your fairy lover becomes real. Yesterday I walked beneath the olive branches and thought how much I'm loving you. April love, loving lovers, love, loving you. How beautiful my Wednesday is with April in it. Thanksgiving. Oh darling, let's go out for a bite of pumpkin pie and a sip of spicy latte at one of those plebeian sidewalk cafe houses where everyone knows our names and everywhere inside smells like home. 